Hey guys, I'm Dieter Melhorn. Come along with us on this trip as we're going fishing on Lake Watery in South Carolina. And we're going to try to catch catfish in every way possible. In the river, in the main lake, drifting, anchoring, shallow, deep. We're going to see if we can catch them every way possible. All right, guys, we went turkey hunting in the morning, got out here a little bit late. So the first place we headed was up into the river to see if we could find a catfish there. Let's see if this one won't go in the motor. Mm -hmm. Is this a striper? He's running off to the side like a striper. Yes, tiny. Tiny one. Cool. Let's go. Let me reach out again. Reel down, reel down, reel down. Okay. There you go. I know the leader's not too. Yeah, it's not super duper tight. So. Reel up some. Reel that sinker right up to me. Bam. Little bitty fella. Little bitty fella. <sighs> Dislocated my knee. Easy. Little striper, not a big one. Flip him back. Screaming right now. Go ahead, Dad. Put your hand back there. All right, guys. There's a little one, but I'm let him go. All right, we move over to our second location. And I got hooked up. Dang, this is a cat fee. Whoa, he took it off. Not sure what we got. Would be a catfish. He thought he was a striper running off like that. What we did was we got uh, two catfish rods out the side. And two striper rods. Striper baits, and he came on a striper bait. Small cut bait. There we go. Simmer, 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 simmer. Eater. Simmer, simmer. That would be a perfect eater if we was keeping them. Let's talk about a wide fish. shot. You're looking at a blue cat. Hmm. I used to get a lot more of these on Lake Watery, but I'm not sure. Keep going back. Sometimes they're here like crazy, sometimes they're not. All right, guys, we made a run down the lake, got out of the river section, decided to come out here and anchor up and just focus on some catfish. Still got some decent current moving through here, uh, a little bit of wind, and the rain has shown up. So uh, it's uh, coming down steady, nothing horribly bad. I don't think there's any lightning with this. Uh, so as long as the lightning stays away, we're gonna fish for a while. Hopefully we can get onto a big fish. Everybody else has pretty much left the lake. The entire river evacuated as soon as the rain started showing up. So uh, we're some of the last hardy souls out here, but it's what it takes sometimes. We're gonna see if we can get on one. We, uh, just a side note, uh, I had a bunch of perch in the tank that I caught the other day and I just checked the filter on the tank. It was full of eggs. I should have got some video of it. Full of perch eggs. So they are definitely 100% making a spawning run up there. And that's where those big females were coming from that we were catching. So uh, we'll see if there's any big, big catfish. We saw some nice arches pulling up in here. And we'll see if we can get one to bite. But I'm going to park it. Stay here out of the rain. Catch fish! Any size? I don't know. I think it's a flathead. Oh, we're on watery. If you catch one here, you've done something. That's pretty good. <laughs> I'd love to get one out of watery. I've never caught one here. I know they're here. There we go, another blue. 
walking around there. There we go. Good, good. Female. 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 All right. Off the deeper side of the boat. He slammed that one. Did you see it? I seen it when you were getting it. I watched it the whole time. He it just he took it. He started. He went ba -ba boom and just folded. Nice. You stay button? Oh, yeah. Okay. Look at you nursing him in. I like that. They folded it so he could be a big one. Stay out of the motor. There you go. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. Got a big nail in there. Walking on the back of the tent. Yeah, okay. That's good. Keep the rod in the middle. That's a big nail. I'm going to put my hand in here in my mouth. You know why? <laughs> well, I'm happy to see a sinker came off. Sinker. 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 Simmer down. There's no reason. To act like that. Hush, open your mouth. There you go. Easy, easy. Dad, it's, it's a blue cat, not a flathead. Easy, come here. Really, I catch it and I can't even hold him? Big old male. Yep. There he is. Yeah, hold him. Hold him right there. You ain't got to get your hand in his mouth. Just get him underneath. All right, we got one. We were just getting ready to move and now we catch a fish. There he is. Good fish, Grayson. He ain't no monster, but we'll take him. We're happy to have him. All right, you want to release him? I'll yep. follow you in. You ready? Yep. Belly flop. Boom, there he goes. Uh, he ain't super big. Oh, I think he hit it like a freight train. I thought he was going to be a lot bigger. Same. So, uh, better okay, than walking you. back, walking back. Here we go. Ah. Kaboom. Better than nothing. That's right. That's right. Better than nothing. Yeah, we just got set up out here. Got some baits in the water. And whammo. We got one. Another eater size blue. Catching a fish. We've caught them in a river. We've caught them on a river point. Now we got them shallow. We're catching them all over. We just ain't catching monsters. But you know what? We're getting another bait in the water. Try to catch another one. All right, guys. Uh, we The rain's gone. Yep, I think we got a fish going. The rain's gone. Uh, we made a move down the lake into a creek, into the back of a creek. We're going to try something shallow. We caught one in the river. Uh, we caught, what, two at the last spot we anchored up. Mm -hmm. we, and we just got that one. There goes a rod right there. Oh, he popped off. Dang it. That's one of those little bitty baits, too. Or there maybe. may be one on this rod, though. I would check this one. Mm -hmm. Remember, this is a flimsier rod, so that Yeah, that's one of the uh, striper self rods right there. Is he on? Yeah, he, oh yeah, he swam way over here. Real, 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 real. You're gonna have to... I hope he went under the anchor. Is he on there? He swam way over there with that bait and didn't hook up. Wow. Anyway, as we were saying, uh, we had all kinds of stuff. I think he got into that line. I think that's why that rod jerked the way it did. Anyway, uh, we're trying some stuff back here. We've got bit pretty quickly two times, so we're going to get some more baits in the water. We got, using the shad, we've also got some white perch, some of the white perch I had in the tank. We're probably going to burn through some of those, so let's see what happens. He's running. That's one of the best blue bites I've seen in a while. I don't know how big he is, but... Coming out the boat, coming out the boat, coming out the boat. He popped off. No, I'm just kidding, he's still there. See if we can get him turned before he gets... Oh, he's right here. There he goes. Oh! Are you kidding me? Dude, he hit it like a freight train. Wow, we got fooled on that one. Let me lift him in. Uh, we both thought that was a... Big fish. He walked back a little bit. There you go. 
Oh. That's all we got. All right, folks, we've only been here a couple minutes and I uh, got a couple of fish and a couple of bites. Had one pull off. Got a couple of them in the boat. Uh, no big ones. But they're biting. We're catching fish all over. Uh, everything we've done today has been anchored. We've not done any drifting or trolling. So I wonder how that would be. I may try that if I get out here tomorrow. But catching fish in all kinds of depths of water. And uh, I think pretty much every one of them has come on gizzard shed. I just started using some perch, so I just got a couple of those baits out. But feisty. Feisty. Mm. Feels kind of heavy. Then again, there's that medium action rod. Oh, uh, my dad hates it when I say this. Is that the fish from last time? <laughs> Back up. Okay, dang. He's a big old male. He go happy to see me male. <laughs> Come on, roll out. Roll out. There we go. Male. There we go. Hello, Grayson. Thanks for catching me. Here you are. There you go, guys. We got, uh, we're catching fish. Looking like a lot of them here small ones, so we're gonna try it a little while longer and see if we upgrade. But for now, we're catching fish. Um, it's a just to give you a little weather update. Water back here is 68 degrees, so it's warming up. It's a cloudy day today. It's a little bit cooler. Overnight temperatures have been in the 40s, so our water temperature is in a good range where you can catch fish just about anywhere right now, and that's what we're doing. We just can't figure out where the big, big fish are. So we're gonna get these back in the water, I like this cover spot. some water. You like this spot? Yeah, you can actually catch fish plus five years ago, mm -hmm. six years ago. <laughs> Not today. This is five, six years ago. On January 1st, I caught my biggest catfish I've ever caught. Cold, pretty cold that day. Muddy water, I remember that. This water was very, very muddy compared to what we got today is really nice. So. Anyway, we'll get some baits back in the water, see if we can find one. Dang, you swam off with this sucker. He's going on a run, isn't he? I thought he popped off for a second. How much you want to bet he's a five pounder? He probably is, dude. I mean, it's fun. To, We're catching them, it's just... It's uh, fun to think you got a 20 pounder, and then it's... They're just not crazy, they're hitting it good. What's funny is we ain't caught anything on those baits on the bottom. They've all been hitting those suspended baits. Here he is. It's probably a bigger one. Big male. Let's see if I can get him in the boat. I should be using a bow gonna do this, but I didn't. Pizza. Catfish. Ah, okay. There we go. Oh, it's so mate. Keep my fingers out of this. Ow. Got my thumb. Fish. Hello, blue. I got my thumb. Let go of my thumb. There we go. All right, say bye. <laughs> this is the one I've been waiting for right here. I was falling asleep at the front of the boat. I heard. You could hear the boat vibrating, couldn't you? Remember, that's only 12 pound line on that thing, so. Uh, if you, is he gonna stay on that side or is he going to the front? I think he might be okay. They got leader, or think. Oh, he, is he, I don't even think he's that big. It's the sinker. I saw him, kind of. Oh, Another little one. Or that drag may be loose on that thing. He sucked some line off of it. Yeah, it's pretty loose. Is it loose? Okay. Dang it. Check the drag before you... Well, hey, it's better to have it too loose than too tight. That's for sure. Let's see if I can get him. Uh, oh, there we go. Get him in the get him in the other line to this keep it. Damn, he's out. 
Grayson doing some angling here. There we go. You're gonna go straight back to it, watch this. Yeah. Going back in there. Grayson putting his angling skills to work here. You know what? Wait, uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, the uh, other way, other way. Other uh, way, yep, go over it, go. There you go. Now go down, go down. Okay, I'm making sure you got this figured out here. Oh gosh, you popped off. Well, that's a good thing. We like, uh, if you're gonna lose a fish, lose five, but yeah, he broke that leader. That's just, I mean, that right there is, uh, a good example guys we're just using this is really striper rigs that's only a 12 pound line that is why you use heavier leader right there so uh, at least i was wanting to play around with some little ones on this lighter stuff so well now i know not yeah there ain't no telling how many fish have been caught on that thing uh i think we're gonna pull up from here and make a move we caught i don't know four five six fish back here i think we're gonna pull out of here and go try one more place and then probably call it a day. It's about four o'clock. We're gonna hit one more spot. Really? One more spot. Anchor in one more place. Try to put one big fish in the boat. We may drift. We may drift. I don't know. Oh, right. We're gonna be back in a few and you'll see what we're doing then. All right, we're back. Uh, and Grayson is hooked up. We went to Dragon, just like I said, where we're going to. We came across a point here that was loaded with stumps, rocks, fishing line something and uh he never got mad i never got mad bad did he pop got a little one oh, no, he's still got a little one we're finding a little fish we get this one to the boat we, we'll have caught catfish on lake watery in every way possible anchored in the river creeks there's another rod behind him boom Okay, you gotta take this. Yeah. Going up. Good eater fish. Good Don't eater size get... one. Huh? Go ahead and get that. Yeah, go ahead and get that uh, B&M rod. Let me Just... give you some more. There you go. Cool. No, yeah. oh, Mr. Blue Cat. Mr. Spiny Blue Cat. He's kind of... There you go. Bring him over here. I need the fire to grab him. He's, he's manageable. Normally when you say that, you throw them and get cut. No, it's the little, he's, he's just above the size that's manageable. All right, boys, got another one going. On one of the down rods. I got these striper rods set up. Underneath the boat, about two cranks off the bottom, just to see what we'll catch. I got me a blue cat, a little blue cat, I'll be it, a little blue cat. I've just got cut bait down there. For some of them, it's hard to resist. We've caught catfish about every way possible today. Well, folks, if you made it this far, thank you for watching. Please consider subscribing, and here are a couple of more videos that I think you're going to like.